Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I will show you about the limit angle map, which is uh, an advanced map that allows you to specify a range of angular values that a component is able to move. So please insert the parts. Three parts have been inverted. Now create a mate one by one using standard mares. Go to mares, select this face, this face, and concentric mate. Okay. Now create coincident mate, select this face and this face, and okay. Select this face and this face and concentric mate. Okay. Now the last mate coincident mate. Select this face and this face and make relation coincident. Okay. So we have created the standard mates. If we move the part and rotate it, we observe that the parts rotate 360 degree without any constraint and the part intersect the other part which is not a physical motion, which is not possible physically. To get rid of this, we will apply the limit angle mirror. So go to advanced mirrors and select the angle limit mirror. Again like the distance mirror there are two values minimum angle and maximum angle. Select the two faces and give the minimum angle the minimum angle approximately 0 degree and the maximum angle 180 degree and click OK. Just move the part, there's the maximum angle and this is the minimum angle. There is some space, so let's re edit the mat and make the angle approximately minus 10 degree. And click OK. Let's see again. 180 degree maximum and minimum. It's OK. Almost OK. 100%. So actually, we constrain the motion of this part 